Either God here coming to you live and direct with another video, and this is part two of my conspiracy theory. Um, like I told y'all, the technology that they use, they showing it right here. I think, like, this is in the movie Wonder Woman, nineteen eighty four, and then it's the year twenty twenty. Vision, open your eyes. Um, I don't know where this location is, but I'm going to show y'all a scene without the sound, but I'm going to explain what y'all are seeing due to copyright reasons. This is, um, the, um, it's the all wishes scene. Basically, it's about, um, all of these people that were making wishes, that, but they had to look into the screen. They were like, they would be making wishes, looking into their phones. Um, TV screens and stuff like that, right? And that's what was giving um, the feeling that what was giving him his power. He needed wishes or he would die. If the people didn't wish for physical things or whatever, the dude was literally decaying. So that's how he stayed alive. He needed people to make wishes. And this is what I believe these beings, um, they use this technology using these screens for us to talk into look at and stuff like that that's how they conjure up and get us to manifest stuff for them you know i'm finna so i'm finna play the play the um uh, scene they wishing for stuff see that see this is the dude that uh see this is the wishing stone he came across that stone and um he wished for something, and him wishing for something made his body um, mortal or something. Like, he just started decaying if people didn't start wishing, but y'all get the point. If you awaken, you get you get what I mean. But I think he represents the government. You pretty much can read their lips. See? Everybody basically wishing for things. See, he dying. See, you see it in his face. He dying because enough people aren't wishing. So he needed more people to wish. And then they got symbolism in the background, y'all can see. The cube, and then you know, you got the TV screens talking about some wishes. See, see how everybody looking to the screen. See, and they showing you different races of people. This is how they conjure up different <laughs> parts of the planet. <laughs> talking about some, I wish they literally wishing for. A, different things see and that's where they conjure up all your wishes I guess they showing you right here this little room look like a UFO spaceship see all them wishes giving him energy he's sucking it up and then you see the White House in the background you see all them wishes Making all that energy flow, causing them papers to start whirling around. You see how he feel happy, cause we up here wishing for shit, materials, matter, and they get all, and they get off with that. They showing you right here. This is how I'm interpreting it, you know. So yeah. So what they're saying is they tell um. Wonder Woman is telling the people to renounce their wish, aka take their wish back, because I forgot what was gonna happen, but she just saying renounce your wish, so everybody started taking their wishes back, because it will be an explosion or something like that. I can't remember. I gotta watch the movie again. See, he said he said wish for more. If you can read their lips, he said he asking the people to wish for more.
and that's how they that's how they get off us using their technology that's how they get all their power you us using their technology us participating us building for them um us doing everything for them but we don't even know it as a collective so that's how they be feeling they be feeling good because we um we we giving them the illusion of power because they don't have no real power so they feed off the illusion of it see they're taking their wishes back now he even took his back because he didn't want to deal with that energy he couldn't handle the energy but yeah that's what i wanted to show y'all that's what i was trying to connect my last video to how they use us to participate in these rituals these trends these dance moves and stuff like that especially that dance that i just showed y'all um the rocking of the hips represents the the shaking of the earth you know um like i said the planet going through a shift a lot of us are unaware of it even personally we all going through shifts and we're going to have to adapt um, to the new system that they're trying to bring up, bring forth. But we're going to see if they're successful with it, you know, as we move forward in so-called 2023, according to the Gregorian calendar. But, yeah, that's what I wanted to show y'all. Y'all see the technology. And this is just, if they showing us this, they probably got way more. Way, they got probably got way more advanced versions of this room, or they might they may just have a lot more rooms than just this right here. But yeah, they putting it right in front of your face. That's all I gotta say. Either God signing out. Peace.